Very good morning, children. In this video, we are going to discuss stomach. Before that, in last video, we discussed Sashank after having chapati. Okay, and he was uh, doing uh, gymnastic exercise vigorously. And I asked whether he will vomit or he will do the uh, send the food to the stomach. Yes, he will send it to the stomach only because of the peristaltic gripness and also due to the sphincters. Very good. Many of you have answered very correctly. Now let us proceed to the stomach. So you all know stomach. What is the shape of stomach? Possible question. J shape organ. And stomach we can find some foldings of muscle like I told you when I was discussing the palate. The muscular folding we call it as rugae. And it is lined by stratified columnar epithelium. What is the capacity of our stomach? Of course, 1 to 1.5 liter to the maximum. Somebody can even store 4.5 liter because it is elastic in nature. Okay, so 1 to 1.5 liter is the Capacity of our stomach. How long the food stored in the stomach? The food is stored around 4 to 5 hours. The food stored in the stomach. Okay. Now what are the compartments? Let us see in the stomach. So if you see... The part esophagus is here and you know the sphincter will be here. And this portion is we call it as cardiac region. Why it is cardiac as it is closer to the heart we refer it as cardiac. And this upper portion we call it as pundus. Pundus will be filled with air. So if the air or gas rises to the esophagus only we call it as gastritis or pyrosis. Okay. A heart, heart, burn, all that. Then this region we call it as body. And in body we have various kinds of cells. What are those cells? We have chief cells and parietal cells also we have some stem cells for rejuvenation, goblet cell of course for mucus secretion and every once in two weeks the mucus lining is changed in the stomach because of goblet cell rejuvenation is possible. Okay and the person can you think will he survive without stomach? Yes he can survive many of you answered yes they can survive without even stomach. So where they will remove the stomach and they will connect the esophagus directly to the smaller intestine and the person has to take liquid food and restricted diet with a regular gap all that. But they can survive without stomach that is the point. Okay so these are the cells we can find it in the body. Then the J shape the curve region we find pyloric antrum of course, here you will have the pyloric sphincter. Do we find peristaltic activity here in stomach? Yes, of course we can find peristaltic activity continues even in the stomach. And it is under the control of my enteritic plexus nerve or arba plexus also in certain group they might have given. So my enteric plexus is the nerve that controls the stomach. Once we eat the food, the nerve will send a stimuli to the brain so that we start churning the peristaltic activity. But not immediately brain is sending stimuli once it is done. So only we are eating also a little more. So once after the capacity, it won't send the stimuli. It will take time and also there. Okay, are you all clear? And uh, you know, 
which of the food item reaches the stomach without any digestion children so that is a possible question no we started our digestion in mouth we started digesting starch there so what is the food without any digestion reaches the stomach please answer me in the comment box and thank you for supporting me